Hello everyone and welcome back. It's yet time again to look at another dive site in central Raja Ampat. This one is called My Reef. As you can see from the dive map, the entire dive site is again located below the surface. So your guide will find it for you. And also a thing to watch out for here is um, strong currents. So very likely that you might need to do a negative entry. Now normally we try and find the shallow end of this reef. As you can see the whole dive site, it almost looks a bit like a bow tie or maybe a bean or something. Anyway, so where we enter, the shallower area is on the right hand side of this reef. And that's where we normally enter and then we make our way down to either side, depending on the current. If the current is too strong, it's very easy. Just go behind the side and hind it. But um, we normally try and go inside the current or into face the strong cu on incoming current. Because again, that's where you get the uh, biggest aggregation of fish. So as you follow the slope, whichever around you go, it's a very gentle slope leading to deep water and a deep sandy area. Um, more to the right hand side, this is normally the route that I take. In that um, big round corner areas where you can very often see quite a few black tip reef sharks and very deeper towards the sandy area, very often also that you see a school of barracudas over there. And the reef itself, there's a lot to see. It's um, quite often that you, again, that you can see a big schools of surgeon fish. Now they can either swim in the blue or close to the reef, as you can see, um, as, as I will show you in uh, the video. And then you can make your way out to the deeper end towards the dive site, which is on the left. But normally this dive site is quite big. We normally don't even go that far. You can opt to go to that side first. But I think on the right hand side, it's a little bit easier, tend to be a little bit more shallower. And towards the end of your dive, again, you know, we try to get to the shallow area of the reef so we can do our safety stop there. Otherwise, you're just going to have to go up to five meters and drift into the current and lose sight of the dive side, which is not a problem, of course. But then again, as usual, remember to send up your SMB so you make, make sure of a safe ascent. That's enough um, babbling about the dive site. Let me go show you what it looks like underwater. Actually, I forgot to mention something. What's really cool to see is all the fusiliers. Now, in the blue, the fusiliers, there's big schools of fusiliers. But what's nice about them is that you can see them whooshing about all of, you know, back and forth on the dive sets because the, the blue fin trevally is hunting them. So you might encounter, well, most likely you will encounter that quite a few times during your dive. So, um, yeah, let's have a look at the video. My name is Jan and welcome to my world.
So guys, that was Sardine Reef. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Those um, fusiliers being chased around by the bluefin trevelis is kind of cool, right? So anyway, um, for the next dive site, we again stay here in central Raja Ampat. And this is uh, the next dive site. It's quite a special dive site. It's one of those that's, you know, during the day, it's really cool to dive there, but also at night because there's so much to see over in this dive site. And it's an easy dive site. And if you want to see what it looks like, you're going to have to subscribe so you can get notified of when I upload the next one. Until next time, take care.